fresh wood here. October, February, October. Wow. February 23rd, 2022, 6.31 p.m. As you can see, OPP, Spencer Mills, as you, 14716. As you can see, Staff Sergeants, Ex-Chief, Robert Kane, Robert Lucas, Stacy, Shelley Huffington, Mental Health Workers, Dr. Tatiana V, uh, Dr. Pritchard, Dr. Barton, Dr. Ambimbola, Dr. Waldron, Dr. McGregor, Dr. Joy Hadley, medical treatment refusals, file falsifications, and a whole lot of other crimes. You are guilty of aiding in this identity theft. You are getting a guilty of aiding in my brain injuring, my lobotomy. William Aldridge also murdered my mother along with Blair Hardy. They were used in tech on her, causing high EMFs and radiation. They also caused my neighbor, I believe, cancer as well. And congratulations, it's Blair Hardy doing this with William Aldridge. But Blair Hardy, since when did you start living at my address, you motherfucker? Because your mail is conveniently being sent here, just like when I lived at 154 Center Street North before I moved here. William Aldridge's mail was being sent to my place. I'm going through identity theft. Obviously, I'm proving it. My deforming, my changes. This is revenge retaliation on me. This is about framing me. This is why I was kidnapped. This is why I had my blood and my piss stolen. This is why I was being charged to prevent me help, to prevent medical proof. And so they could get away with this. This is OPP Spencer Mills. This is OPP Staff Sergeants kidnapping motherfuckers. This is OPP Shannon Cork. If you wouldn't have laughed in my face when I told you to arrest your boss, this wouldn't have been going on, and my mother would still be alive. This is OPP X Chief. This is OPP Robert Kane, Robert Lucas, Shelley Huffington, Stacy the mental health worker, Dr. Pritchard, Dr. McGregor, Dr. Joy Hadley, Dr. Ambimbola. Dr. McGregor, Dr. Pritchard, Dr. Waldron. You're all involved in aiding in this crime against me, medical treatment refusals. I'd go to the hospital. I'd tell them what's going on. They wouldn't even check me when I was going there. I never even had as much as a stethoscope put on me. I was being belittled, being treated like a piece of shit, put in different rooms where nobody could conveniently hear what was going on. And when I would get up and leave, it was being made to turn around like I was the one refusing treatment. No, I was being belittled. I was being treated like fucking garbage. And I was not about to sit there and take it. But this is their way to turn this around to make it look like I was refusing them. And that is not the case. Not the case. Shave my head today. How the fuck can I be doing this? So congratulations. I am how the murdered and missing and are happening. This is how people are being framed. This is how people are disappearing. Identity thefts, injuring, torturing, sodomy, sex assaults. Your human traffickers, human sex trade slavery traffickers, drug traffickers, pedophiles, obvious identity thieves, financial thefts and frauds from elderly, from disabled. Lies, cover-ups, time-buying, arrest refusals, except for on your victims. Since August of 2019, I would sure like to know what the fucking chief, ex-chief, had shot in my ear when he went by in his white jeep. He waved at me. I believe that was a sign, and then the black truck beside him conveniently pulling up and pointing and shooting something at me, and it going into my right ear. 
me being screwed ever since. Stacy showing up at the hospital, talking to doctors, talking to her girlfriend Tatiana, and Joy Hadley, aka Margie V. Tatiana V. aka Margie V. I've 100% proven my deforming. I've 100% proven my identity theft, which I said was going to be the result. Just like I talked about them killing my mother, that they were going to, what was happening, and, and my mother was going to end up dead from it, from how it was being done. And as a result, it was, it caused cancer, just like my neighbor next door. Blair Hardy was spending a lot of time conveniently at Mike's, Mike Gordon's. And now my neighbor conveniently in my next apartment has cancer. My identity theft is obviously fucking happening like I are done. While well, William Woldridge is sitting at 149 Center Street North while well, Blair Hardy and the rest of them like can so con congratulations time bought since 2019. This is what happens when you speak of police crimes. This is what happens for revenge retaliation. And that's exactly what this is about, including my charges. That's to prevent me medical help. That's to prevent and keep me away from the hospital. And this is to try to get me to fuck me even more so you can try to get away with what you're trying to get away with. This is why I was kidnapped. This is why I had my blood and piss stolen. This is why Spencer Mills wanted my, my prints and everything else for this to frame me and all of And I will not be proven wrong. I will not be proven wrong, motherfuckers. So congratulations, every single one of you bastards. You need to be arrested and you all need fucking suing. Who's going to pay to fix this? Who's going to change me back? Who's going to fix this damage? Certainly not the doctors involved. Certainly not the fucking cops involved. And certainly not Waldridge and Blair Hardy and Tyler Lake and J2 Step, the rest of them, who are fucking street junkies working for Spencer Mills. They're human traffickers, human sex trade slavery traffickers. This is how people are being framed. This is how people are disappearing. This is how the murder to missing are happening. And it's conveniently by cops, as I've been saying, and doctors. So I am proof. Identity thefts can happen, and it did. I hope you're happy with what you're trying to get away with, Waldridge and OPP and the rest of you fuckers, but I'm not taking a fall for him. Wanted inmate, little cocksucking fucking bastard. You're nothing but terrorist murderers. Christ would love all, hate none, watch yourselves and your children, because these are dangerous motherfuckers.